This is Asia Tonight. Good evening, I'm Oteli Edwards. Tonight's top stories. Emergency talks for Malaysia's ruling coalition. Party leaders are discussing if the Prime Minister should step down. Protesters in Thailand keeping up the pressure on the government as Parliament resumes to tackle the crisis. A pledge from Japan to become carbon neutral by 2050. The promise comes in Prime Minister Yoshihide Suga's first major policy speech. Vietnam braces for Typhoon Molev. The powerful storm has already caused widespread flooding across the Philippines. Melbourne gets ready to reopen after a four-month COVID-19 lockdown. For the first time in months, there are no new cases. Hello, I'm Dawn Tan, coming to you live from Washington, D.C. I'm Steve Lai. Also tonight, Donald Trump begins a swing state tour as the final full week of campaigning for the U.S. election begins. He might be trailing in the polls, but a big victory is on the way for the president. His Supreme Court nominee is expected to be confirmed in the next 12 hours. And I'm Elizabeth Neo with your Asia Business Update. Singapore accelerates its move towards solar power. And China says it will impose sanctions on U.S. firms involved in arms sales to Taiwan. Crunch talks are underway in Malaysia as the fate of Prime Minister Muhyiddin Yassin hangs in the balance. Barisan national leaders are said to be discussing if they should ask him to step down. A Supreme Council meeting of UMNO is now underway. Political turmoil at the very highest